Hey everybody, BrickLover18 here today with my Brick Badge Overview. If you've ever been to a LEGO convention before, you know that Brick Badges are a big part of the conventions. The idea is every convention you go to, you get one of their convention bricks, and you keep adding it to your Brick Badge to make it longer and longer. Typically, the bigger your Brick Badge is, the more LEGO conventions you've been to. My Brick Badge here consists of a lot of different bricks. Bricks from conventions, bricks from companies, just custom made bricks, as well as custom made bricks by me. So the first brick on my brick badge is this Brick Lover 18 brick. This is a custom painted brick by me and I liked it at the time but now it's kind of not so good looking because I guess I didn't do a very good job painting it, but it still does the job. This next brick is a Brick Lover 18 on YouTube brick. This is two separate bricks and one's actually a tile, but I can't take them off because as you can see, the back is where the magnet for the brick badge actually attaches. Next up here, we have these two by two brick plates actually, and it's obviously the red, green, orange, and blue, and this is from Brick Fair 2013. Down here, I have a Lego printed tile, as well as my Brick Lover 18 printed tile, where it says all Lego all the time, and it's got the, like, the images of the social media links I use. I also have a 2x2 brick in yellow. Down here is actually all the different QR codes for my social media sites. As you can see, I have a red brick, a, a red tile, a brown tile, a blue tile, and a green tile. The red tile is obviously for YouTube. The brown is for Instagram, the blue is for Twitter, and the green is for Bricklink. Down here, I have the Brick Fair Virginia 2013 brick. I also have the Brick Fet 2014 one, and I actually have two of those because I went to Brick Fet 2014 Toronto and Brick Fet 2014 Ottawa. As you can see on this level, I have the Canadian flag as well as the Ottawa brick. I have the Brick Fet 2015 brick, and to go along with that, I have the Toronto brick as well as the Ontario flag brick. I have this iHeart Brick Arms brick, and it is definitely one of the coolest bricks I have on my brick badge, mainly because it's all engraved and it's not not engraved, sorry, embossed, and it feels really squishy because it's kind of like rubber. I have this custom www.bricklover18.com brick. As you can see, this is a custom decal brick that I made myself just to kind of show you my website. The last brick that I have on my brick badge is this unofficial tube lug brick. This tube lug brick is painted mainly because the tube lug does not actually have a brick yet, but I don't really know how long I'll keep this tube lug brick on the brick badge for. Thanks everybody for watching this video by Brick Lover 18 showing you my brick badge. I really like my brick badge and I think it's a really awesome thing I had. I used to put my sig fig on it, but after losing a couple of conventions, I decided I'm not going to do that anymore. Thanks everybody for watching, I hope you enjoyed and feel free to let me know what your brick badges look like. Thanks so much for watching this Brick Lover 18 LEGO video. If you enjoyed this video and you want to subscribe for all LEGO all the time, click the subscribe brick and you'll subscribe to our channel. If you want to see more of our previously uploaded LEGO YouTube videos, check the cards as there's a playlist there containing all our videos. If you want to see more Brick Lover 18, head on over to BrickLover18.com where you'll find the links to our Twitter and our Instagram and our Brick Club. Before you go, don't forget to leave a like on this video as well as a comment. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already by clicking the subscribe brick. Thanks everybody for watching and I hope you have a great day.